just as they do every Saturday, the anti-government but civic-minded yellow vests took to the streets across France. The presidential election is less than three months away, and in a race dominated by essentially far-right ideas, President Emmanuel Macron appears likely, at this point, to win re-election. That idea seems unbearable to the Yellow Vests, who have long predicted that a return of Macron will push the country into social uproar even worse than in 2018 and 2019. The great majority of yellow vests refuse to march with the far right. We think it's for others to join us and not for us to join them. Why? Because we are apolitical. But the first day that the sanitary pass law was validated, we marched against it. Today, the vaccinated and the unvaccinated do not have the same rights anymore, which is against the Constitution and the principle of equality. Despite poor weather, over five 500 people gathered at the Bastille in Paris to remind voters that five years of Macron's self-professed neoliberal revolution has translated into soaring economic inequality, worsened public services, and reductions to the long-standing rights of retirees, the unemployed, workers, and others. Other yellow vest protests in Paris include one which opposes a recent government decision to look the other way on an open den of crack cocaine. That protest slogan is no to crack in Paris. Last week's change of the highly controversial anti-coronavirus sanitation pass into an even more controversial vaccination pass has reinvigorated weekly protests led by the far right. Yellowvest said they resented the inaccurate efforts of many mainstream media to try and conflate the two groups, which the media appeared to have done ever since the Yellowvest protests began. If Macron wins, that will be a catastrophe. And I hope that all the people who didn't demonstrate will be back out on the streets because his re-election is just unthinkable. I think the yellow vests will be even angrier than they were before. As the election nears, many believe the social climate in France will only grow more cloudy. Worsening inflation, an election campaign dominated by Islamophobia and xenophobia, looming record abstention, and possibly increased yellow vest marches all appear increasingly certain. Ramin Mazahari, Press TV, Paris.